February 4th, the Broward County Historical Commission and Museum held its grand opening celebration at its new home in the historic Westside Grade School. Many notable figures were in attendance, including the mayors of Fort Lauderdale and Broward County and the governor of Florida, Charlie Crist. It's truly a pleasure to be here, ladies and gentlemen, in the heart of the Sailboat Bend Historic District and the historic Westside Grade School for today's grand opening. What a special treat for us all. In Florida, we are fortunate that no other destination has such a wide array of experiences with so many stories to tell, from Native Americans to Spanish settlers, and ultimately as the unique and diverse state that we are today. I want to congratulate the Broward County Historical Commission, who are so dedicated to preserving our great history for their commitment to making this grand opening a wonderful reality today. Broward County Historical Museum will surely provide opportunities for generations of visitors to experience history's ability to transcend the culture. The number of people here today, elected officials, dignitaries, volunteers, everyone who is here, evidences the importance and broad appeal of preserving the history of Broward County. I know that I speak on behalf of the entire Broward County Commission when I say how proud I am that we were able to work together to make this dream come true. The Historical Com Commission and Museum finally has a home. I am personally grateful that we will have such a fine facility to house and Broward's most valued artifacts. How appropriate that this facility is one of Broward's first schools and is itself a historic landmark. This is our historic district and this is an area we never want to see changed. Now we've got residents of Sailboat Bend here today and I know that you could not be more delighted and more proud to have this in your community. So congratulations. We as the city commissioners of the city of Fort Lauderdale, Florida, we hereby proclaim Thursday, February 4th, 2010 as Broward County Historic Commission and Museum Day in the city of Fort Lauderdale. The Broward County Historical Commission was created in 1972 following the efforts of Circuit Judge L. Clayton Nance. Originally, there were five historic commissioners, an advisor and a historian, and meetings were held in Judge Nance's office in the county courthouse. Today there are 22 seats in the Historical Commission, including seats representing Archaeology and Anthropology, the Broward County School Board, and the Seminole Tribe of Florida. The purpose of the Broward County Historical Commission is to promote and protect the history of Broward County. The historical collection includes a library of over 2,000 books, over 1,000 reels of microfilm, and over 20,000 images, all focusing on South Florida history. Archaeology and cultural resource protection are also important elements of the Historical Commission's efforts, as the Historical Commission is the official cultural resource repository of Broward County. The Broward County Historical Commission is dedicated to preserving records and artifacts of the county's heritage and to raising awareness of local history. If you'd like to learn more about events like this one, or about the publicly accessible archaeology sites in Florida, go to www.flpublicarchaeology.org